Welcome to Let's Play Midnight Club Street Racing Part 16. In this segment, we're going to be going this way here in London. We're going to meet back up with Emily and uh, do the do her second waypoint in head-to-head -head races. So let's just uh, our way over here. Try to meet up with this bitch in the only good car that you get from London, like I mentioned in the last segment. Like, yeah. And it's, hi, how you doing? What up, Emily? I hope this version of her car is much more stable than the first version because, oh my god. Like, I hated racing Kareem in the first version of her car. It was so bad. But yeah, I'm hoping it's upgraded, like, the kind of like how the Jones was, you know, how the, uh, Holy shit, the J400 had an extremely soft and wobbly suspension, but the 420 and 450 were much stiffer and therefore much better to drive and corner with. Ooh, hi understeer, how you doing? Excuse me, everything. I have a bitch to catch. I've caught the bitch, and then I lost the bitch again because I got stuck on a building, because that's what happens in this game. If you even think about touching a building with any part of the front of your car, the entire nose becomes attached to it. Such is this game's physics. This game really does not work, like, at high speeds. Like, it does not at all. <laughs> Holy crap. Like, anything over 100 miles per hour, you just pretty much have to pray for the most part, that the game won't cuck you. Okay, I probably didn't need to zoom in that much, but hey, whatever. Also, I just realized, no uh, nitrous on this car. So, Kareem's the only cool kid that gets nitrous on stage two car, excuse me. <laughs> I say that, and before Emily has nitrous on this thing. We'll find out once we, at the end of this segment, when we win this car from her. Ooh. Anyways. Who's the starting line? Our next waypoint race. Aye. Maybe. If I don't lose her. Okay, she took a very stupid way around there. Thank you. Hello. Oh, she's got top secret decals on her car. Ooh. Isn't that neat? Still love how there's like actual like tuning brands like decals on these cars. Like, these cars are entirely unlicensed, but we gotta have licensed tuner brands, man. Street racing, bro. And we made it to the start line. Alright. Let's do this shit. So, here we go. Next race, and it's... Well, it looks straightforward, but it also looks like, uh... Maybe some, uh... Shortcuts might be used. I don't know. We'll see. So, let's see how bad I struggle with this waypoint, because I've struggled with every waypoint so far here in London. Also, it's raining. That, that's another thing. It's raining. So, uh... Excessive wheel spin off the launch. Just get all the wheel spin. One homeboy decides to go a different direction for no reason. Alright. You go ahead and do that, buddy. Gonna do this and understeer like a motherfucker. All of the understeer, give it to me. The game is also kind of sad. Frame rate is being very jumpy. Again, that might be an issue with me emulating this on the PS3. Not sure. Well, you are a surprise. Probably is actually. Cause I doubt. Oi. Game had this much slowdown on PS2. What is everybody doing? Oh god. Um. Hi, police car. That somehow worked out in my favor. <laughs> okay. Fucking. The gods are smiling on me now. Holy shit. How? Just like, oh god, I'm spinning and I've lost control and my car's in an unrecoverable slide. And yet it took me the. 
well, not precisely the direction I needed to go, but it was a route that wasn't, didn't cost me any, as, or any time. Also, I just barely won that. Emily was right behind me. All the homeboys are way the fuck back, but Emily was right on my ass, as well as these cop cars. Too bad we're not gonna get any kind of scene with the cop with Emily trying to speak to me and the cops just bursting in, destroying everything. Fucking love that. Like the entire start of this LP. Anyways, the homeboys are coming crashing in, literally. Come flying in and crashing into this wall. We still await one homeboy. I'll give him another like five to ten seconds and then I'll just give up. Oh here he is. Never mind. Yay, alright, now. Let us call up Emily. In me, in me, in me, in me, in me, in me, and do our next head-to-head, -head and win her car. And hope, hope and pray that this car is much better than the first version. Please. So here we go. Next head-to-head -head against Emily. And stuff. These London, these London uh, routes are definitely a lot more complex than New York. That's for damn sure. Then again, the London map is a lot more complex than New York. Hey, it's dry. Good. There we go. Head to head number two against Emily. <clears throat> Let's do this. Dry road, but still spinning the fuck out of my front tires. Cause front wheel drive, baby. Why are we going this way? Seems like a not very smart way to go to reach that checkpoint, but okay. Whatever. I need to take the next intersection. So let me just do that and fuck it up immensely. This way. This way, combat. And what there's Emily. And she fucked up somehow. Go me. Oh, I'm just getting lucky with these. Oh, she called me a wanker. All right. And go on. Very bad way. Here's an alleyway that I missed initially. But it's fine because I got it now. Should probably use fifth gear. That'd be a good idea. I wonder if this thing's a four speed and automatic tra with automatic transmission. Holy shit. I need to start using the handbrake, I think. If I can remember what the handbrake button is. I think it's circle. The default control scheme, which is kind of what I'm using now because I reloaded my save and it did not save my control setup. So I'm using control scheme A. So, uh,. Yeah, fuck. Come on, we're almost done. Make it, make it around the turn. We made it around the turn. We got police out on my ass, but it's fine. And victory! Crash into the bus. Yeah. Boom! Colossally fucked by the policeman. Oh, and tipped the bus over. Nice. Fucking perfect. Best way to end the race right there. So there's our second victory against Emily, and hey, this is my first London segment where I didn't fail either of the races. Holy shit. Actually, I haven't lost... Actually, I have lost some of the head, one of the head heads, but still. Yay! So with that, we get the Ascent 237SI, which has acceleration and handling increase, and hopefully it's a lot more stable. Please be a lot more stable, please. I beg of you. But that'll conclude this segment. So second round with all the uh, hookmen here in London are complete. So next time we'll be going meeting up with Kareem for the final time and uh, taking his last car. So with that, stay tuned for more Midnight Club Street Racing. <laughs>